welcome to Heidi's home. I've already had my coffee this morning and I realized that my coffee bar really needed a good wipe down and a spruce. We really use this coffee bar. <laughs> I mean, if you have been watching me for a while, you all know that Ron and I absolutely love coffee. So it gets utilized. Um, so I'm changing the I don't know if you guys have ever seen those dry mats that you get from the Dollar Tree, but I use that underneath my coffee pot so that there are no um, drips of coffee or water on my furniture and it won't ruin the top of my coffee bar. And it has worked out really, really well. I usually change the mat about once a week. So I went ahead and I changed that. I'm also getting out some of my fall mugs putting away my summer mugs and just kind of giving, you know, my coffee area a good clean out today and kind of everything moved around because I absolutely love my coffee bar, but it kind of ends up being a little bit of a catch-all for things. But today I'm going to get it all cleaned out and get everything wiped down and it's going to be a good feeling. As you could tell this morning, I had the pumpkin spice coffee creamer. I have been so enjoying the taste of it. It is so amazing. I love it. <laughs> I, I cannot wait for cooler weather, but it is not here yet. It is still super warm here. So I'm putting in some new coffee cups that I got, I think, last year for Christmas. And I've just been wanting to set them out for some time, so I got those out. I'm giving my table a good spruce. And now I'm in the bathroom, and I'm scrubbing the toilet, and I'm wiping down the sinks and everything. I do this every, pretty much every morning. And it just helps to keep everything managed. I wouldn't consider what I do every day to be a real, real deep clean, but I do want to make sure that everything is wiped down in case we have company. I'm using just a, like the generic Clorox wipes. They came from Menards. I got them super cheap. They do a great job on a pinch and I just wipe off the sinks and the handles and get all the garbages out and everything. Now today I'm going to Aldi this afternoon so I'm putting all of my refrigerated bags, I call them refrigerated bags, but my big cooler bags all together in one big bag so I have those ready. I always fold a load of laundry pretty much every morning and this was a massive load of laundry as you can see here. But every morning I just try to tackle those things that will make my day go a lot smoother because it's already done. It seems like, you know, dinner's not such a chore, putting up the groceries isn't such a chore because I've gotten the things that I kind of don't like to do out of the way. And laundry is definitely one of those chores that I hate to do. I really hate to do laundry. I don't mind the washing and the drying, but it's the folding and the putting up that seems to be the trouble for me. But I, if I really push through my morning and I get that done, then my day just seems to go a lot smoother. So I honestly really do suggest that in the mornings to tackle at least one job that you don't really care for because it kind of motivates you to push through the rest of the day to get the things done. Thank you. 
Now I'm just simply making my grocery list and I'm getting all of my things laid out for the bus. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. If you are new, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you again soon. Bye, guys.